French military forces have been stepping up their action in Ivory Coast, where a conflict between two claimants to the presidency is becoming increasingly bitter. French helicopter gunships fired missiles on a military camp in Abidjan shortly after Nicolas Sarkozy in Paris gave the go-ahead for his troops to join a UN operation against forces loyal to Laurent Gbagbo. Gbagbo has been clinging on to power since a disputed election last November, even though there's widespread international opinion that he lost the vote. The standoff that followed has steadily deteriorated into a rerun of the country's civil war between 2002 and 2003. But now, Bagbo forces are being increasingly hemmed in in Abidjan, which is their last stronghold. The French Foreign Ministry said two of its citizens were kidnapped, along with several other nationals, as fierce fighting swept through Ivory Coast's main city. Forces loyal to Alassane Ouattara, the man internationally recognised as the rightful president, have been flooding into Abidjan after swiftly taking control of the rest of the country. Their commanding officer has predicted that once the offensive begins for real, they will take the city in 48 hours.